Hey guys, a little bit of update on the channel. Uh, we went a while back. The Vermilion Parish and Lafayette Parish were both having a promotion in Lafayette, Louisiana on adoptions for both dogs and cats. And well, we need some cats around the property to help us with mice. And my wife wanted a cat to keep in the house and, you know, for, you know, because I guess she's a cat person. But never quite figured that out. But anyway, we went ahead and got new stuff. See, we got a new litter box, automated system. We got the kitty litter to put with the litter box. It automatically cleans itself. You only have to empty it once a month. We even brought a cage to go pick up the cat. We get to the event. Well, we get to one of the events because one of them was at the Lafayette Pound, a Parish Pound. And the other one was at the Lafayette City Pet Smart. When we get to the Pet Smart, we buy the equipment for the cat. And, uh, well, we look around at the cats and, you know, stuff. And let me show you what we got. Everybody, I want y'all to meet Kenny. Kenny is approximately three years old. We don't know the exact date. He was dropped over off at the pound two years ago. And he's he's a little spoiled. He wants out because I'm talking to him. <laughs> but uh, he's very gentle despite his size. Charlie gets along with him. They play around. I keep him in his kennel part of the time during the day because he does have a little bit of a running problem. But he stays in the house at night. He's very good potty trained, but there we go. <laughs> That's our cat. <laughs> we still got to work on getting an actual cat for the property or a cat or two for the property. But being that, you know, with the dogs and stuff, they need to be good with other animals and that's kind of a rarity for cats. It's easier for actual dogs. Now, when we went to looking at Kenny to adopt, and we were actually serious about adopting him, what I did, I took him on a leash and I brought him inside the Pet Smart. And uh, I'm sorry, I was noticing if extreme zoom here. I'm not sure how to fix that. I took him into the Pet Smart and brought him with the uh, the cats that was in there for adoption. And be honest, he paid them no mind at all. I brought him to the side. They had one side of the, uh, the display that was just cats that were friendly to dogs. So they weren't hunching their backs or hissing or anything when he approached. So, and he paid them no mind. I literally walked him within five feet of the cages. So he looks like so far he'll be good for cats. Uh, He gets along obviously with other dogs because he gets along with Charlie and Charlie doesn't get along with many other dogs So we're going from there We always try to give big dogs and uh, big dogs a chance when we adopt animals They tend to be the ones left behind at your local adoption agency So if you are looking to adopt a dog, I suggest looking into the larger breeds and the older ones because to be honest the puppies go first and these older ones like Kenny he literally sat in foster care for over two years before we adopted him and he's a very pleasant dog I walk him without a chain to him from the house we play we all play together he gets along with Charlie Charlie's sitting there eating, trying to chase bugs and as far as Charlie's shock collar, I will be doing an update on that. He's not wearing it right now because we find he doesn't need it all the time anymore because his training is going very well. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for watching.